Hello, everyone. My name's Dr. G. I'm the principal at Hoover Elementary School, and I love science. I hope you do, too. I heard that you guys have been doing a lot of neat things about weather and about the wind, and I thought maybe I could share with you some things that I know about wind vanes. Have you ever heard of a wind vane? Do you know what a wind vane does? Well, let me tell you a little bit about a wind vane. But before we get into that, I thought since we are first graders and we are scientists and we are engineers, it would be a blast to actually build a working weather vane. And then we could make predictions about how this wind vane is actually going to work in the real world. Okay. So what you're going to need are some su supplies maybe like a very small straw that you might get from like Burger King or McDonald's or something like that. And then maybe some sort of like jumbo straw, like if you were going to get a big milkshake somewhere. Okay. And maybe some construction paper and then maybe um, some scissors. And of course, whenever we're cutting, we're going to be very, very careful. We might even have an adult around to make sure that we don't hurt ourselves. All right. So what I've done here is I took a jumbo straw, dun, 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 and look at that. I made a hole in the middle and I put a slit here and a slit here. Now, this is going to be the front of my wind vane. See, kind of like an arrow. And this is going to be my tail. All right, look at that. Dun, dun, dun. All right, have you ever seen anything like this? Maybe on top of a barn or something like that? All right, maybe in the shape of an animal or something. All right, now, I've got my skinny straw. Remember, this is the big jumbo straw, like the milkshake straw versus the soda straw. And I'm going to kind of push this through the holes that I lined up perfectly, okay? And see that? It's going to allow that to kind of turn a little bit. Now, if I wanted to, I could get a piece of tape and I could tape it down. I could even make more slits here. But sometimes for me, I like to go wild and I don't like to finalize things till I got it ready and working. Now, look at this. Woo! It's like something cool from the playground, right? Now, make a prediction. If the wind were coming from, let's say, this direction. Which way do you think my arrow would point? Think about it. Would it point in the direction of where the wind is blowing? Or would it point in the direction of where the wind is going? Share with a partner. All right, maybe we should test it out. Luckily, I have dun, 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 a fan here, a box fan. All right, and I'm going to crank this baby up. And let me see here. I'm going to try and put this in sort of a neutral position, maybe sort of facing me. All right. Here we go. Test our predictions. Wow. Look at that. Huh. What a good scientist does is always test their experiment several times to see if you get the same results. All right. So this time I'm going to point it. The arrow's pointing that way. The wind's coming from this direction. Which way do you think the arrow is going to point? Let's see. Come on now, full blast. Huh. I got to be honest with you, that's not what I thought would happen. But it looks like the wind must be capturing the tail. Okay? And it looks like the tail then spins around so the arrow points in the direction from where the wind is coming from. 
That might be very helpful if I were playing a sport. I wanted to know, am I going to run into the wind or am I going to run away from the wind? It might be very important if I'm a pilot. Am I going to fly when I'm taking off into the wind or against the wind? I don't know. Maybe farmers need to know which way the wind's coming from. Look at that. That's very interesting. I think we're going to have to go outside and test this too. I love science. Hey, Dr. G out here again. I thought we'd try my weather vane or wind vane in a real world situation. And it is a little chilly out here and it's a little windy out here. And uh, I don't want to get hit in the face there, but wow, that wind's flying around. Which way is the wind coming from? Huh, I think it's coming from that way where my arrow is pointing. Interesting. Wow, isn't science fun? Have a good day. Stay warm.